Hey, 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 what's up, y'all? It's me, LSP. Good Wednesday morning to you. We've made it over the hump, so let's get at it, y'all. I knew Michelle Obama was cool. I did. I thought, you know, I didn't think she could get any cooler, and then all of a sudden, she did. Remember on Monday, I told you about little Miss Curry, who was infatuated with the picture, just enamored by the portrait of Miss Obama. And um, so her photo went viral, and Michelle Obama had um, commented on it, on the photo, but she took her coolness up a million points yesterday. She's already met that kid. Lil Curry's already danced it out with Miss Obama. So that is so cool that she got to meet her. Michelle Obama, you're just, you're the queen of cool. You reign supreme as coolness queen, all right? So then, here's your wacky Wednesday story, y'all. A guy t <laughs> got drunk, okay? He was drinking, and uh, he took it. He called for his Uber when he had finished his evening, you know, being a responsible adult, out there adulting. Fell asleep in the Uber, went from West Virginia to New Jersey. <laughs> he, <clears throat> excuse me, $1,600 ride, y'all. No, I know how drunk he is. I do. I'm not that type of person who'd be like, I don't know how drunk he is. I, no, I know how drunk he is. But I, I don't know how drunk that is. I don't I don't know what $1,600 worth of drunk is going to look like. Because at that point, I'm going to have to get a GoFundMe, start a GoDaddy page, call my daddy to gather up enough money to cover the $1,600 Uber ride. And not only did he do that, but he then, um, it was the Uber XL, so he was paying more. God bless you, buddy. Always have a friend. That's why you always got to have a friend who does not drink as much as you. Thanks, punk. I love you. Thanks for being my best friend. You always got to have somebody who does not do what you do because, whew, especially in this day and age, that's something to think about because I don't drink like that anymore. I'm, I'm, I'm grown. I really do adult. But, um... It's like they have this phone in their hands. I mean, the well, see, now I'm going to tell on myself. I do drink. <laughs> I'm silly. I, I'm so silly. I'm so silly. Uh, but a couple of weeks ago, me and some friends were having some drinks, and I did try to um, get a hotel and get a hotel on Hotels.com. And luckily, it didn't go through. I remember getting my card out and everything, but the next day, I was like, well, Shonda, did you, did you get a hotel? Did you, did you get a hotel? So I, um, I went back and checked, and I didn't. I had not gotten it. Luckily, I must have entered the credit card numbers wrong. So, yeah, I reckon I do do stuff like that, but not $1,600 worth. But that's what I was saying. Living in this day and age where we got this phone in our hands and... and if I was drinking like I did in college, the stuff I would have ordered, because first of all, you know, in college, back then, they mailed us credit cards. I mean, you just open your mailbox, and there's a credit card. All you had to do was call the number, activate it, bam, you're in. I mean, I, I'm i still paying for food I ate 20 years ago. But <laughs> that's another story, y'all. But anyway, so in the age of technology, you got to be careful with your drunk, all right? I'm done, y'all. The interstate's right up here. To the 196 people who've taken the time to click that little red button, we are indeed thankful for you. If you haven't subscribed, think about it. We make great content over here on LSP Productions. Give me that old thumbs up. Let me know you're out there watching and comment below. Do you know how drunk he is? What have you done? Huh? Share. Talk amongst yourselves, y'all. I'm done. I'm on the interstate. Take care of yourselves. I will see you tomorrow. As always, no fear and no regrets. You're awesome.